<clears throat> hey guys, I'm back with a quick video. It's late. Me and my daughter just finished doing a late night workout. New video will be up tomorrow. Um, I just wanted to have me a little bit of quiet time before I go up to bed. And I just made me <clears throat> a cup of tea. Sleepy time mint. This is the tea right here. I'm just trying to have a little peace and quiet before I go up. And sometimes I like to do this in the morning time. I used to get up really early in the morning, have a cup of coffee or have a cup of tea before everybody get up. That meaning through the school week, I try to get up before I get the kids up to just to have a little time to myself before the day get crazy. Um, I'm so happy that I'm getting back in a, in a group of things and I'm, I have been holding myself accountable I've been holding myself accountable on, on my journey. You know, I've been reminding myself and I've been just tracking what I eat, tracking the things that I eat. And I've been doing really good. I've been doing really good. But what I, what I did was I noticed some people, they work out before they eat, before they eat. And I, I did that today, this morning, I got up and, uh, Usually I eat something, but I didn't. But after my workout and I, my, my family was up and I got up to start cooking and I, I wasn't feeling good. See, I know I don't like to, I can't do that. A lot of people like to do that, work out before they eat. I have to eat something because I wasn't really feeling good. Yeah, but anyway, I just really wanted to take the time just to myself for a minute and just um, reflect, reflect on the last few weeks. On my mood and my energy and I'm just so happy to be again getting back into the groove of things and trying to make it fun trying to I want to try to keep my kids involved you know with me still put the work in and do what I need to do for me for myself but also enjoy it and and know that what I'm doing is is there's a there's such a bigger purpose in it. And it's again for my overall health and for me to just I just want to I just want to find a way to be consistent in whatever it is that I'm doing and still be able to my goal is yes is to be healthy but yes yes i want to i want to drop the weight i do want to do that i want to feel good in my skin i want to feel good in my skin i already i'm already getting my confidence back just imagine i have six kids my oldest is 23 and i never put so much effort into myself putting back in putting back into me and my my self care and taking care of myself. Yes, yeah, I'm really mean self-care and putting pouring back into me. I never really have done that, you know. My focus was always what my kids need, what my husband need, things that I do on a daily, and I'm I'm going, going, it's just like the energizer bunny. I was always going and forgetting about me. And I just feel good that um I'm doing that. I'm starting to put myself first. I'm trying to balance things out. I'm trying to balance things out um, and stay at it. I'm just, I just, I want to find a way. I want, again, I want to find what works for me so that on not only when I drop my weight, keep it off. That's all, that's all I'm trying to do maintain a healthy weight and continue to be healthy and and just be consistent and again i've been saying and holding myself accountable for everything that i do on this journey you know i don't want to be taking big wide gaps and weeks off a couple of days off and not really putting my um best effort into my workout because it's too early in my journey to be doing that i, I don't want to lose focus that's all. I don't. I really don't want to lose focus. I don't want to lose focus, and um, yeah, um, I'm a bit tired. I want to just drink my tea, and uh, 
the hell? Who is that, my son? Yeah. What you doing? Your garage door was open. It was? Yeah. Why? You going out? No. Hmm. Next Why you got all your clothes on still? So how to my YouTube? Well, look at my son. It's late and he, this how he been looking all day. Playing a game with a hat on and a sweater. What else you today? Um, it's bedtime. Take a shower, put some, you got pajama pants on. We'll look on the couch down there. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's wrong with these teenagers, but yeah, I'm about to get ready for that. Again, a new video will be up tomorrow. Just did that workout with my daughter. Um, I hope you guys check it out. Good. Hey, my sunflowers. Um, I am. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, my kids is up, and my son want to be taller than everybody in the house. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> no why? The doctor lied and told me he was five seven, but I'm pretty sure he ain't five nothing nine. but five six. So I guess he is five six, maybe five six and a half. Five nine. So he want to be five <laughs> seven. Oh my god! What? Wait a minute. How tall I said you was? Five seven and a half, but that was before. Well, he yeah. think he five seven five, and a half, but I think half. whoever did that messed up. He is not. He's short. not. He's you. He's just you a little bit. Paige, get hit down on the floor if you want to. He is just a little bit taller than me. Get back, Paige. Stand by Paige. Paige is five five, so she is. Tell me, this boy ain't no fast. <laughs> Please tell him. Please tell me. It's no, no. Please tell me. No, I'm not looking at the hair. Please tell my son he is not five seven. How about you stand up? He's not even five seven and a half. No, I'm five six. And I just, exactly. I just get. Stand up. No, you're not just taller than me. Stand up. Because if I'm taller than you, that means I'm taller than five six. That means I'm. I five, said you just a little bit taller than me, Nati. Just up. a tiny stand bit. I'm, I'm drinking my tea. Stand up. No. Stop it. <laughs> Stand up. I was just down here at peace, dude. Here they come. <laughs> no, stop. Stand up. I'm not standing up. Stand up. Ah, oh, you're not taller than me. Oh, yeah. Not. Good night. Good night.